Welcome to my channel guys. I'm doing a quick video to debunk the driver power increase between 2211.1 and 2211.2 causing GPU issues. Um, I plan on doing some more in-depth deep dives into drivers and driver troubleshootings. Help encourage me by doing that by giving me a like and a subscribe and thank you guys. So before people start screaming that driver version 2211.2 is killing GPUs, which they already are, I'm here to show you um, that the power is the same between the two different driver versions. Here I have hardware info open. It's going to show you all the information. What I'm going to do is I'm going to drop a quick load onto this and then I'm going to um, update drivers to 22.11.2 and show you that drivers and power has not changed any. And then I'm going to show you power at it too. Let's turn the sound off here. Now you can see temperatures here is going to be great. Here's your power and voltage. Your um, core current. And I can't click without minimizing heaven here. What do you see? No huge powers here. I'm going to take a screenshot of this so that I have it whenever I carry over. So we can do side by side. But I got a load on here. And we can see the power. The wattage. And everything else. And you can see it's changing because I have a load on it. I'm going to go ahead and exit. And I will be back in a minute after I update drivers. Since I got to do some editing here, I figured I'd just show you. I'm on 2211.1 and um, now we'll go back to the new drivers. Okay, so I've updated to 2211.2. I now have the screenshot from Hardware Info before. And here's my voltages with zero load. We're going to put a load on it real quick. Full screen, that'll work. And it actually looks like the voltages are a little bit lower. Oh, no, they went back up. Everything looks the same. 133, 130, 1356. Over here, you got 1350. So it's just a little bit. But that could be something in the load, too. 1.510, same thing, max. So, now, I'm going to go ahead and add voltage. And if you can see, everything's pretty much well the same as far as all the other settings with power, wattages, and everything else. But I'm going to take it a step further, and I'm going to load MPT up on the... Um, system and we'll be back to look at that as well okay so we're back now I have this is 11.2 this is 11.1 have all the voltages and stuff right here right now we're gonna go over here I'm actually on a software mod to increase voltages and wattage look at my power difference at idle. I mean 113, 1 through and 3 6, 1 1 
um, 6.4. Look at my wattage difference. 575 watts, 320 watts, 320 watts. Look at my um, PPP limit, 488. Here it's only going to be... Um, Two eighty nine and two eighty nine, so I've increased the power quite a bit. And what I'm going to do is, if you can see, my voltage is already really sky high because I'm recording the video on the system. And you see, it falls back down to where my minimum is, everything else. And if I open up Heaven Benchmark, hopefully my system doesn't crash because of the load, um, because I haven't done this much work before. Um, see, it instantly goes up, and we'll watch the clock speeds jump up to 27.44, because now the card's being pushed. The issue would be within uh, maybe a pad or a paste issue, or a old mining card, um improper BIOS on the card. There's going to be many factors here, but the one thing I can say is drivers don't change your voltages. You have to change other things to change voltages like that. Um, so you don't have to panic and worry about the voltages on your um, between the drivers changing. Like I said, I can go in. If you look over here, 1.236 is my max. My max here, 1.3 or 1.133. And I can keep going on and showing you all the different things. But that was to cause panic. It's not that. They need to dive deeper into it. More testing needs to be done before assumptions should be made.